digital marketing has been traditionally a B2C play. In your view, how can enterprises in B2B space benefit from digital marketing? Yeah, it's an interesting question because at Pavilion, we actually kind of straddle that line. We have a B2B part of our business, and then we also have a B2C part. And um, we almost have an element of our business that's e-commerce-like. And and the interesting thing about e-commerce is that those businesses live or die by the performance of their websites and by you know, their ability to affect outcomes through direct response marketing. And so they are highly performance oriented, highly data driven. They have very experimental cultures that are really agile and move quickly and iterate. And I think in B2B, because we have longer sales cycles, um, because a lot of things are more sales led and attribution can sometimes be trickier. I think we sometimes lean on that as a crutch and we are, we are not as data and performance driven as those B2C marketers have to be by necessity. And so I do think over the last two years, this is starting to shift though, because with a lot of um, venture capital starting to dry up or become harder to get at least, I think a lot of companies are shifting their mindset from this growth at all costs mindset to this profitable, efficient growth mindset. And to be profitable and efficient in your growth, you can't just throw money at problems, right? You have to be very granular in how you identify what are the channels that are performing? How can we make small tweaks that will improve our performance? And I think that that's starting to bring B2B marketers a little closer to B2C marketers in terms of the mindset that they bring to the job, and it's forcing them uh, to become more data-driven and performance-oriented.